Hey everyone, welcome back to 10 on YouTube. Now, for this episode of 10 on YouTube, <coughs> sorry, I'm going to be listing my top 5 favorite minivans. Now, I can tell most of you are thinking, Oh, minivans. In fact, here's an impression of a troll doing it. Oh, minivans suck. They don't deserve to be around anymore. Oh, they're gay. Yeah, no, I love, I happen to love minivans. And I can tell not everyone in this world is a minivan hater. Like I'm not. You're such a mama's boy. Just kidding. Imagine if you were. Yeah. Anyway. Where is a mechanical pencil? Um. I need to find a pencil. Yeah. There's my notebook. Huh. Do you mean Patrick? Yeah, Patrick is watching Law and Order Special Victims Unit. It's one of his favorite TV shows ever. If you don't believe me, watch the uh, watch his top five favorite TV shows from TV Talk. Ooh. Yeah. Now I'm not gonna tell this. In the, now I'm not gonna tell this the top five favorite minivans in the top in the top five, in the in the um order of uh uh no in, in five four three two one order. I'm gonna tell it in one two three four five order. Let's write the date. Write the write this. And I'm also gonna hang this on the wall right around here. Like right there. <clears throat> yeah. Okay, so number one is the Honda Odyssey. You must be thinking, why that minivan? And please don't ask that it's uh, backwards. Anyway, the reason why it's the Honda Odyssey is because it's a Honda car, and it's really amazing with features like a like a uh, dual screen D DVD player, and also a built-in vacuum for the 2014 version, and a cool box for uh, the mini refrigerator, and, and a big armrest, a bunch of cup holders, seating for eight, and also a flip up built-in flip up trash bag. Don't believe me, watch the uh, 2013 vi first video of the... You know what I mean. Number two is the... The Chrysler Town and Country. Yeah, the Chrysler Town and Country, I'm really amazed by this car. It seems so amazing, and also the Honda Odyssey is a backup camera, and so does the Chrysler Town and Country, at least starting with the 2011 version. And at some time, it had it had this it had this um swivel swiveling seats called Swivel and Go seats, and that's totally amazing. Although it had it lacked consumer interest, so it's not in the uh, it's not in the car anymore. It also, it also it also has dual DVDs. It has a lot of lights, a lot of cup holders, seating and seating for seven. A feature in which you in which you press a button and then and then it full, and then the seats fall back and upside down and you know there's you can, you're still able to sit and and you're and you're sitting because you know if you're some place for this or you know what I mean. And there's also ow. There's also it's also MP3 compatible. It has a map system ow. It has so many features and you can also plug in a PlayStation and stuff like that. Now the reason why it's my second favorite minivan is because at first the Chrysler, Chrysler Town Country didn't see much as a good driving test. It didn't, do, it didn't really do good at driving during its test during some of this time. I'm not really sure why, but you know. Number three is the Nissan Quest. The Nissan Quest. Has a, is a very great car. I really love this car. It has, in fact, in fact, these three cars also have heating seats. 
Yeah, it's true. It has heated, heated seats, all three of them. But but the Nissan Quest has, but the Nissan Quest has has heating seats that 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 start that fuel up or whatever quicker than other other cars with this. It also has it also has an eleven inch screen for DVD play for DVD and playing games and playing a laptop. It also has USB ports. It has it has it has very cool features. It also it also has dual 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 panning moon it's a dual panel moon moon roof. You know like you know like it has two two windows on the top. It also has it also it, these three cards also have shades for ow in my tongue. It has shades for the um. For the uh, back windows, it also they, in fact these three minivans also have have second rear window second rear windows that 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 fold that, that um flip that you know that slide down with a push of a button. Duh. In fact, the Nissan Quest has this feature in which you um in which you have the intelligent key with you. You push your foot in the brake. You push the st push the start button that starts up the uh, vehicle. And you're ready to go. Number four is the the Dodge Grand Caravan. The reason why it's number four is because it's almost it's like the Chrysler Town Country, and it had and of course it, you know it's a pretty cool car. Although it's you know like the only reason why I would like it better than the Town Country is because it's older. It's older, seriously. In fact, it's the first minivan ever. And number five. You might think. You might be a little shocked with this. Now, the Dutch Grand Caravan and the Toyota Sienna. Yes, yeah, seriously. There are some features in Toyota Sienna that are amazing. Like built in recliners. How amazing would that be? to be in a car. And I've never I mean now there there are firsts on the minivans. Like Toyota Sienna is the first car I know to have built in recliners. Nissan Quest the first video to have a pumper, you know, a pump a bumper a pumper to uh pump up your tires. And the Honda Odyssey is the first minivan it, no in fact no it was the first car to have a to have a built in vacuum called the Honda Vac. Three cars with firsts, three, three minivans with firsts for a car. That is what I call amazing. Now to hang this up, let me get the pin. Yeah, I kept this with me for a little while. Okay, let me hang this up. Oh, jeez. <clears throat> Ouch. Okay, here we go. There we go. Oh crap! It's tilting. Whatever. So I uh, will see you next time on Ten on YouTube. Bye.